Contagious ovine digital dermatitis, or CODD, is a relatively new condition in the UK. So there's less evidence available for this condition, but as far as we, we know, that it's an infectious condition, it spreads very rapidly between sheep. The signs of the disease are red ulcerated areas at the top of the coronary band, so that's where the skin joins the wall of the hoof. These will often then join together and spread down towards the toe of the hoof, and you'll often find that the whole horn of the, the wall horn will actually separate from the underlying tissue. CODD is a very, very painful condition, and so sheep who are affected can be quite severely lame, although you may find animals that aren't lame with the disease as well. When CODD is first introduced to a flock that's not previously had the disease, you'll often see quite a serious outbreak in the first year, so you can see up to 30 to 40 percent of the flock affected, and this is often a good way of knowing that, that, that this is the condition that you've got. It's also worth bearing in mind, because foot rot is present on a lot of farms in the UK, that when you examine a foot it may have more than one condition, and so that you may have CODD and an underlying foot rot infection as well. So there's still research ongoing into the cause of CODD. It appears to be an infectious disease and it's thought to be a bacteria, but one different to the bacteria that causes foot rot. Because research is still ongoing into the cause, there's also less available evidence for the best way to treat CODD. So a lot of the evidence we do have is anecdotal. The best advice we can give is to use a long-acting antibiotic injection and a topical antibiotic spray. Some cases may take longer to resolve and therefore they may require repeat treatment. It's worth rechecking the feet of affected animals perhaps 10 to 14 days after treatment um, to ensure that they've recovered. If you do not already have CODD on your farm, um, the biggest risk factor for introducing the disease is purchasing new stock. Um, so biosecurity is very important for trying to avoid introducing the disease. It's important to quarantine any new stock and to check the feet of new stock on arrival at the farm and treat any animals that appear to have any kind of disease. It's also important to try and check the history of the farm where you're buying animals from if you can to find out whether CODD has been previously diagnosed on that farm. Even if you already have CODD on your farm, it's still important to maintain good biosecurity as this can help reduce the levels of lameness that you have in your flock.